Hello, this is Greg. I have a new device here. It is the, let me go up here a little bit. It's the Finerci VSO TC4. And let me switch to the desktop really quick over here. This guy right here. I ordered it off of AliExpress. Now, let's go through. All I'm going to work on today is the toolbox, okay? I have been going through this. There's only one of the items that I can't test, but I want to show how to use the rest of these. So when you turn it on, you can change how this sets. Not the point of the video, but this is how this one turns on, and you can change what comes up first, the oscilloscope and stuff. But let's go over here to the toolbox. Click OK. And the first thing we're going to want to do is the voltage test. It comes with this little probe. It goes to the, uh, read that, the 40 in, or in 0 to 40. And uh, I have a couple of uh, fully recharged, rechargeable batteries. And you just stick it on there. 1.3, 1.4 volts and 1.4 volts so that works set those off to the side let's go down one this on off test is to test resistors this is a 390 ohm resistor so you just stick it in the little slots here and 386.1 you see that good yeah all right and that's simple resistor test. And then diode, Zen a diode test, which I, I absolutely love this, that I have something I can test. It's all in one equipment now. And oops, it's in backwards because it reads seven and change. So we've got to flip it around. And that's a 2.4 Zen a diode, which it is. It says 2.360. It's actually a 2.4 is what it pulls out at. So it does those just great. I don't have one of these to test, so apologies for that. The DT, the DHT11, stick in here the same way, boom, and click uh, OK, or is it, no, yeah, OK, and it gives you the humidity, 44%, uh, and which, you know, if you have one of these and you're on-site testing and you you think that maybe the problem is moisture, you can have one of these and just turn it on and it'll tell you what you got going on in the room. As humidity wise, temperature is easy. Most things will tell it. I don't know, I'm an amateur. Don't pay any attention to me if I'm being stupid. Okay, uh, IR code. I have four remotes. This is the only one that it works on. It's just a no name, but it does work. You know, it functions, channel up, channel down volume up, volume down. So, yeah. Now, it doesn't read all of them, but it does read this one. So, and these other ones, they're fully charged. Oh, and uh, I pull it off and on again. Just move the little bar to clear this to, you know, try another remote. And the other ones, they just don't, don't work. So, and then to calibrate is just click the calibration button. And you wait for it to calibrate. Seems to me it should have been on top to calibrate before you do all of this, but I've calibrated it several times and that's it. And then to go back to the main screen, just a short click on the on off button and then to turn it off, a long click. I hope this helps somebody uh, either use this or figure out whether you want one of these based on what's in the toolbox. For me, that is, uh, that's a major help for when I do put together kits. So thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day.